just the sort of weather the fans were hoping for this evening. It's absolutely ideal. My name is Derek Ray, and with me is my commentary partner, Lee Dixon. And this is where it all starts in the UEFA Champions League. The group stage and match day one. My goodness, so much to look forward to. It is Rennes versus Manchester United. Yeah, cheers, Derek. Well, what a big moment for this club and these fans. But as underdogs, you've got to put the pressure on early doors. You've got to use that home advantage, push back the team that's playing against you, and hopefully get a goal just to put the pressure on. for this match if you like wingers you'll love this league yeah absolutely I love to watch a winger play especially with pace and power the central striker will stay more or less in front of the goal the support will be provided by the three central midfield players the back four is pretty conventional but the full backs will be asked to support from behind Here's the lineup for Manchester United. And you tend to know what you're going to get tactically from this team. High pressing. Well, high pressing, high energy. I played this system at Arsenal many a year under George Graham. It doesn't half work when it works well. Sometimes you can just get exposed to the back, but they've got it down to a tee, to be fair. Aguer. And it's with Nzonzi now. And he could really get at the opposition. That's how to blunt the edge of the opposing attack. Scott McTominay. Well, he's a player who just seems to get better and better. I'm talking, of course, about Bruno Fernandes. Lee, what do you think we'll see from him in this game? Well, he's got amazing finishing ability. And when a player's got that, it means you have to go that extra yard tighter. And when you do that, you leave space behind you. So it puts the defender in two minds. And they continue to advance. And a lot of options here. Crisp tackling. Bruno Fernandes. And Rashford. And return to Shaw. Cavani. Rashford. Shaw. Rashford. It is to be a throw in. In Zonzi. Poor attempt at a pass, really. Still pushing for the goal that would put them ahead, but not forcing it. More than decent, this, from United. It looked as though he almost forced the shot that time. Well, it's OK shooting from there, but you have to test the keeper. Aguer and Zonzi couldn't hang on to it. Greenwood. Here is Fred. Precise ball movement. A oh, tremendous vision. Too much pace on that particular pass.
in Zonzi in a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here here's Burigo and they find a gap in the defence and they deal with the threat this time Marcus Rashford and a goal kick given what about the opportunity from earlier let's have another look now shall we Jeremy Doku. Here's Traore. So tight this game. Who's going to break the deadlock? Be brave. Be a hero. Take chances. Fred. Mason Greenwood. It's a fine United move in the making. Juan Bissaka. And here's Fred. Bruno Fernandes. Good defending to prevent the chance. And breaking at pace with Menace. Has the strength to hang on to it. And they have possession again. The referee has decided there will be just one minute of added time. Options in the centre. The first half here comes to an end. Edinson Cavani hasn't quite brought the influence to bear on the proceedings that we thought he would lead. Yeah, well, he just needs to introduce himself to the keeper. He's not been near him all day long. Really needs to up his work rate, he really does. Try and get his team an advantage. And so the second half of this Champions League group stage match day one contest commences. Cavani. It's with McTominay. Maguire. Bruno Fernandes. Tight. And just couldn't keep the ball. Can he play it in? Scott McTominay. On to Wan Bissaka. Edinson Cavani now. Cavani with a slide rule pass. And there is the goal that gives them a well merited lead. It had been coming. As we can see, right place at the right time. Striker's instinct is to be there or thereabouts. Keeper has no chance. Well, let's take another look at that goal, shall we? Underway once more, Manchester United have hit the front. Half an hour remaining then. 
far from a good pass. Traore. Take some progress with the ball at his feet. And Zonzi. And do they mean business on this occasion? It looks promising. Well, still searching for the equaliser, but not passing it anxiously. Nzonzi. In possession, Flavio Tai. United have it once again. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw-in. Here's a change for Manchester United. Zonzi Nayef Aguer has it Terrier he's taken on his opponent here the referee spotted the infringement and it will be a free kick in a position of genuine menace and the keeper was up to the task Ground to make up, and perhaps this corner can assist them. Well, the crowd are doing their bit. Can the players do theirs? They need an equaliser. And now the delivery. It didn't happen for them. Del Castillo. Da Silva. And the cross is very much on. And moving the ball nicely. Laid into the centre. Well, that was anything but a textbook header, Lee. Well, to be fair to him, it's not the easiest of chances. Just caught you off the top of his head, really. Time for the change now. Juan Bissaka. Pogba has it. Cavani. James. Bruno Fernandes. Fred with it. Bruno Fernandes. Might be a chance here. And a goal here. There it is. They've done it. Well, he's gone for pure power, and why not when you've got a rocket in your boot? What a strike! A chance to revisit the goal. And United will switch things around personnel-wise. Well, a second goal for them here. But for Man United. And it's a case and of just five minutes left. Well, he's given it away. Bruno Fernandes. Matic on the ball. Marcus Rashford. And the referee is going to add on three minutes. 
Well, Derek, if you don't close down, you don't work hard without the ball, you don't put a shift in, you end up with a performance and an atmosphere like this. The fans are not very happy at all. Been poor today. Well, no way through. And that brings the action to its conclusion. You've got to say, Lee, a horrible night at the office. That's the last thing you need. Start of the qualifying stages. You don't need a zero point, Sally. You almost need memory loss now to forget about that. Down to five games to qualify. Well, a strong contribution, as we've come to expect from Bruno Fernandes. Lee, interested to know what you made of his performance. Well, that was a really, really good performance from the lad and a goal to boot. Really delighted with that goal, I'm sure he is.